Hello everyone, this is Twiggy. Christmas is coming. Are you busy shopping for Christmas? In this episode, I'm going to show you how you can use D1 Pro to make some Christmas declarations. I'm going to show you step by step how to make this three dimension Christmas ball. So here's what you need to prepare. D1 Pro, honeycomb, air assist, 3mm basswood, rope, material pin, scissor, paper tape, spread paint, and laptop. To avoid leaving any laser mark on the wood board, we're going to use some paper tape to cover both sides of it. Now we're going to place this onto our D1 Pro. First, let's use the material pin to pin each corner of the material. Not only the material pin can help you fix the material, but can also flatten the surface of the plywood. Now let's set the focus. Put down the setting bar, loosen the taco tag, make sure the tip of the setting bar is touching the surface of the material. Pull up the setting bar and move to the top left of your material. Turn on the power of D1 Pro. Don't forget to turn on the power of Air Assist. Now we have our hardware ready. We're going to use the USB to connect the laptop. Now we're going to go to our software. Open Xtool Creative Space. Make sure that your D1 Pro is connected to the laptop. Now we're going to go to Project, and you're going to choose the first one here. And we're going to hit Start Project. Well, we don't need those two today, so we're going to delete these two and move this up. Make sure they're aligned together, okay? And select these two. Make sure, first of all, you choose Laser Flat, and then you choose User Defined Material. And we're also going to use Cut. Make sure you run this at 100% power and 5 millimeters per second. And now we're going to go to process. First of all, you want to make sure you do the framing. Head framing and head start on the machine. Okay, the framing area is good. And now we head framing complete. And you're going to actually start the project. Head start on your software and hit the button on the D1 Pro. Now the lasering process is complete. We're going to take it out. We're going to take these things out and take off the paper tape. Now let's take off the paper tape. If you don't have paper tape at home, you can also use alcohol to clean the surface. And use some file material to clean it. Here comes my favorite part. Let's spread the paint. Now let's spray the snowflake. Once your paint is dry on both sides, now you can start to assemble. There you have it. Okay, our Christmas ball is complete. Of course, you can also use D1 Pro to cut and engrave some other materials. Please let us know in the comment section what else do you want to see us to create. And that's all for today's how-to video. I'll see you on the next one. Ciao, ciao!